Hello there everybody, this is John Runner 88 here with another Star Wars figure review. And this time it is Obi-Wan Kenobi from Attack of the Clones. This is the reissued figure. And here's his card back. Obi-Wan on Geonosis. Uh, looking concerned. Um, it's a fun little figure. Um, it's a good time for them to come out with it too, considering the Kenobi series. We had a fun little flashback in that. Um, and also to go along with the Anakin re-release, um, which is his first foray into the vintage collection. Unlike Kenobi here, this is his re-release with the photo reel um, face deco, which looks pretty good. Get a close-up up there. Um, pretty good. Um, I know the likeness hasn't always been superb on this figure, but um, the photo reel definitely helps. Um, I think the hair color is probably the biggest issue as far as it's, I think it's a little too reddish or orange. Um, I think if they put a little more brown in that, it'll probably look pretty awesome. Um, but he's a fun little figure. He's got most of the articulation we look for these days. Um, he's missing the, uh, the newest addition to the, uh, vintage collection, which is pretty much a a given now with new um, figures is like the ankle rockers, which this Anakin actually had um, years ago, which is he was ahead of his time. Um, but, uh, you know, he's got ankles, knees, he's got uh, um, ball jointed hips, but um, they're a little, little limiting. Um, they're kind of the old style. Um, he's got swivel wrists and he's got a pretty good, um, just like the, I like the Mace Windu um, re-release that they did. Um, they both got very good um, articulation here. I really like when a figure has got a nice ball in the in the waist because they can really get some fun articulation going, um, and it doesn't like break up like the the look of the figure at all. Um, he's got his for accessories. He's got his robe, which is pretty good. Lays pretty good. The hood falls down nicely. Um, he's got his little communicator, which always fun getting little accessories like this. And his lightsaber. But you're just like, oh, cool, a lightsaber. And you probably come with a hilt to put on his on his belt, right? Because it's got a, a little saber plug there. Um, he doesn't. Um, I actually figured that out um, before he came in. I was looking at some pictures on uh, rebelscum.com. Um, it's where I like to go for my, uh, uh, if a figure's a little older, I'll go there. They've got a nice, uh, photo archive there. Um, and it said, a uh, redundant saber port for, like, the articulation, pa like, pictures that they do. And I was like, why is it redundant? And it's because he doesn't come with a hilt. Um, which is a little annoying, um, especially because he's got the saber port there. He's got a little plug there for it. Um. And it, it would have been so easy, but they do, like, almost, like, one-to-one, -one, like, re-releases for these guys. They don't update them too much. I know with Anakin, they updated him a bit um, with the new robe and stuff, but that was his, like, first um, addition into the Vintage Collection. But I have this. This is from an old, crappy Obi-Wan figure. And it just had, for some reason, just swappable hands there's this one that comes with like an opened up hand to like slap people with i guess um and i'm thinking of um like just you know cutting the hand off of that and just cutting the saber off and just having a hilt for him why not it's actually like the perfect size in comparison to um the one that he comes with <clears throat> i mean this one's not like perfect it's like a little a little warped and bent but it's just older and you know it'll work so i might do that eventually um but i know i'll get it to plug in i'll probably just stick it on with something if i ever want to take a picture of him um with it but he is a pretty good figure and the hips they're kind of like they kind of have like a there's like here and here and there so there's like three spots where it wants to like sit which can be a little annoying when you're trying to get them into some um specific poses but um other than that it's a fun little figure if you don't have him pick him up um i recommend him 
he is a good boy, good boy figure, and we love seeing that. Um, like I said, definitely um, a nice timed release for Hasbro um, in conjunction with the Kenobi series. Um, but yeah, just got the thumbs up. Um, so yeah, go ahead, um, like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff. Um, uh, follow me on Instagram, JohnRunner88, over there. Um, see some, I did some fun, um, kind of, you know, master paddle on pictures over there with Anakin and Obi-Wan. Um, had some fun with it. Um, utilizing some, uh, Mattel Jurassic World figures because, um, Hasbro's not making, uh, any animals or creatures for us. So, gotta use what we have, I guess. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye, guys.